Welcome back, everyone. My name is Rich. We're playing more of The Witcher 3 today. Um, nothing too crazy going on, but you might notice a change in the procession of the videos. That's because the webcam for this video got totally messed up, so I have to redo the entire video. So, not a big deal. That happens from time to time. What actually happened was I muted the mic and forgot to unmute it. Because I'm a genius like that. Okay, well, without further ado, we are going to do Disturbance. Turn up the volume a little bit on my end. And we're going to help Yennefer. It's going to be very, very interesting. So we're, we're working on part of the Ugly Baby quest, as you can see. Hoping Yennefer. We're supposed to do different parts of quests to continue the Ugly Baby quest line. So. You decide to blow us up? Geralt, I'm sorry, but I'm in no mood for jests. What's eating you? Let me think. That was the third crystal to explode. It's been a week, and Lambert's still not done what I've asked. Vesemir spitefully insists on repairing the wall just beneath my window and starts hammering at the crack of dawn, while Eskel seems to have gone mushroom picking, not forktail hunting. The guys. Well, they're not exactly happy with you. Hmm? Why is that? Because you aren't willing to say what you're planning. You're treating them like pages, not including them. Us, actually, because I feel that way too. I shall explain everything, when the time is right. First we must finish our preparations. Hmm. You got trust issues with us? No. Actually, I fear you don't trust me. So, I'd rather keep certain things secret, for the time being. Pretty tortured logic. It may seem that way now, but you'll understand in time. Heard about the bed. Really prefer to sleep on the floor? Wouldn't recommend it. That stone can get awfully chilly. Frankly, I prefer a chill to bedding littered with red hair. Ah, so it is about Triss. Yes. It's about our dear, darling Triss. Geralt, I don't want to seem like a vindictive shrew, but that very bed is where you just happened to fuck a dear friend of mine. Yes, I know. You'd lost your memory. Whatever. Let us agree that I will refrain from scolding you while you will stop mentioning that stupid bed. Agreed? Agreed. Splendid. On to more pressing matters. What's interesting is they never mention that in the game. You'd have to read the books to know. Oh no, that's Witcher 2. You'd have to have played Witcher 2 to know about him losing his memory. That's not in the books, I'm sorry. Yep. Fine. What do I do? Firstly, help Eskel and Lambert. One was supposed to get me Forktail spinal fluid. The other was to fortify the phylactery with elemental power. I've yet to see anything from either of them. All right, I'll talk to them. Anything else? Yes. There's one other trifling matter. As you saw, my megascope's acting up in rather spectacular fashion. I'm certain there's an energy source nearby, generating disturbances, making the crystals malfunction. We must find it and neutralize it. Quickly, I must contact someone. It's urgent. Who you plan to contact? Or is that a secret too? No secret at all. Ida Emian. Remember her? How could I forget? Member of the Lodge, Elven Sage. Exactly. A sage. 
As the name suggests, she should know a great deal. I'd like to ask her for advice about Uma. Satisfied? <sighs> You're a sorceress, friends. The sage and not-so-sage. They've let me down before. But if we gotta, we gotta. If only you'd been this cautious with all of them. But no matter. Thank you for your permission. All right. How do I find the source? Use this Potesta Quisitor. Potesta... Potesta Quisitor? Sounds fancy. Complicated. Yet it's ever so simple. Grasp it firmly, move it around, and the louder it squeals, the closer you are. Mm -hmm. Spare me your juvenile wit, please. Well, what are you waiting for? Ah, one more thing. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Geralt. Yay, we have a new item. Nothing here. The Potesta Quisitor. Nothing here. Oh god. This is ridiculous. So... We're off the map a little bit, it looks like. Nope, no big, no biggie. Signal. Signal's growing stronger. So, Yennefer found a volunteer to walk around with that chirping stick after all. Looking for Siri. Ashen hair, scar on her cheek. Seen her? Uma. How can I help you? Think universals exist as real and distinct entities, or only as mental constructs? Mm -hmm. So do I. <laughs> it's gotta be a joke. So long. Aha. Getting warmer. Warmer. Hot. It's not bad. It's not the coins. Not an axe. No reaction to dimeridium. It's not bad either. Ooh, the wild hunt. Look 
look at the fire. Now look here. Pupils functioning normal. Too cold. No reaction to die, Maridi. Oh, climbing up nothing. Can't be far now. Not cow's milk. No. Like that? Pretty, isn't it? Could it be Uma? Follow the dots. Pulse mm. weak, but regular. Oh, I've already checked all this stuff. Oh, that's my stash. Okay. Hmm. I can dump some stuff off in it if I want. Far now. Look at the fire. Ah, getting warmer. Warmer. That string. Hot. Got this top one. Nope. Yes. What is it, Wolf? I met with Amir. Any crowned heads you haven't met? A few. Hoping it stays that way. Remember the first war with Nilfgaard? Battle of Sodden? The North, all of it, fought together. Tamaria, Vidania, Cadwin, Eden. And the mages were heroes. On the field first, then in ballots. Not much left of that world. See you later, Vesemir. Uh -huh. Getting warmer. Warmer. Hot. Hold this. This is ridiculous. No reaction to die meridian. Mm, much colder. Signal. Shit, lost the signal. Nothing here. Oh, got a signal. So this thing? Signal's growing stronger. Like that? Pretty, isn't it? Can't be far now. Interesting. Uh -huh. Getting warmer, warmer, hot. Already checked all this stuff. Urgh. It's gonna be like right in front of me or something stupid like that. I can tell. No reaction to die, Ah, 
Oh, the dream just are. never took off. Like Couldn't click on this, I thought. Disturbance is coming from there. What's in these crates? Dimeridium bombs. Lambert made them. No wonder the megascope doesn't work. All right, gotta get him out of here. I can do that. Rather you not make a mess of my shelves, just keep an eye on Uma. Yes, Uncle Vesemir. How goes it? Vesemir's not working you too hard, I hope. Uma. Thought so. All done. You can go. Now, let's check your conditioned reflexes. Oh, now I just gotta tell Yen that we have taking care of the problem. Thank you. Seems to be working now. What was it? Dimeridium bombs. Lambert left them by the beds. Hmm. I suppose he had no idea they could interfere with my megascope? You know, Lambert's not exactly an expert on megascopes, so... Please. Lambert is mean, not stupid. Enough. Ready for this conversation? Sure you want me here? Members of the Lodge don't let just anyone in on their secrets, or so I've heard. Consider it a token of our trust. Now let's begin. And Geralt, behave, please. Didn't you just say you trust me? Stop twisting my words. Cadnell Yennefer at Vengerberg. Gwynblade? Cadmill and Severn. Why have you summoned me? We've come up against a curse. One we must lift. It was uttered in a dialect of elder speech unfamiliar to me. I see. The words of the curse? Va fel elen, ked mil foli, gled of dawn eptenid bondro isne iacus. Take it you've heard the words before. Yes, in legends, of the kind that do not end happily. Can you help us with the curse? To a degree, Agnes de Glanville's incantation, combined with Elder's triangle, inverted, of course. They are your only possible recourse. But I cannot guarantee that even they will suffice. Thank you, Ensevern. Va fail. That does not conclude our conversation. Let me guess. You want something in return. If I may, Gwynblade, I'd like to request... Stop guessing. Just listen. The time of the white frost and white light is nigh. And the world will perish amidst ice. I know Ithleen's prophecy. I don't doubt you know it, but do you understand it? The Elder Blood can initiate the final age, the time of the end, or stop it. Remember this, Gwynblade, for you will be the one to determine if the seed bursts into flames. what she was talking about? Siri, of course. Wish everyone would just leave her the hell alone. Wouldn't count on it. All in all, interesting conversation. What now? You can start by apologizing for acting like a boor, despite my asking you not to. I'm sorry. It's just when Ida started in with that patronizing tone. You decided to prove she was completely justified to adopt that attitude. Well done, Geralt. Bravo. Oh, 
Oh, enough. Finish whatever it was you and the boys were planning to do. Then we'll begin. Okay, well. Either talk to Lambert or help Eskel. Hmm. Yeah, I'll decide. Both will be fun. Oh, sweet music. That's all I got, though, guys. Thank you for watching. Um, I will see you next time. Take care and goodbye.